What's up, guys? Uh, today, we're going to talk about uh, three metaverse projects that I think are going to do good in the next bull run, um, 2025. So first, we're going to start with Sandbox, guys. But first, as always, not a financial advisor, not financial advice. Make sure you guys do your research. Don't go buy these products, simply projects, simply because I am talking about them. Make sure you look into them for yourself. Um, sandbox guys, number one on my list, no particular order that I'm going in guys, by the way, I just like these three metaverse plays going into the bull run. Um, I do hold a significant bag of sandbox. Um, I'm very bullish on it. Sandbox did big things in the last bull run. And I think it's going to continue to be a leader in the metaverse, uh, and gaming, in my opinion, going into the next bull run. Uh, hasn't been a whole bunch of talk about it, but let's have a look, guys. It's got 68% in circulation of its supply, 30 cents right now, guys. It's a good buy. I believe it reached like seven, seven and a half dollars in the last bull run. Uh, I think somewhere between 10 to 12 is realistic, depending on how much money flo flows into the asset class, um, as a whole. So uh, so yeah, hey, I got to pause and cough. Sorry guys, cough's still pretty bad. But uh, anyways, Sandbox big, did big things, guys. I foresee big things moving forward. Pick it up uh, pretty much anywhere. Binance, BitHub, uh, uh, KuCoin, Coinbase, Uniswap, Kraken, uh, pretty much anywhere. Um, fantastic play in my opinion. And guys, some people say, well, you know, sandbox, you know, it's not doing anything or whatever. They're doing things, guys. Like, look at, do you think, like, look, this is just plots of land in their metaverse. Do you think that these companies just going to, you know, it's all just going to go away kind of thing, right? Here's a list of companies who own plots of land in the sandbox. Atari, Pransky, uh, CyberKongs, Binance, uh, Ubisoft, The Walking Dead, Gemini, CoinMarketCap, MediKey. Like Warner Music Group, guys, like these companies, you know, Animoca Brands, uh, you know, Axe Infinity, um, you know, Crypto Kitties, uh, 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 Flow, like just all kinds of companies, guys. There's a lot of big names pouring in there, and there's just, there's way more than that, too. So, like, it's not going anywhere, in my opinion. The Sandbox teams up with Sandsoft uh, to expand presence in Saudi Arabia. The Sandbox, a prominent decentralized gaming virtual world and uh, subsidiary of Animoca Brands, has unveiled a strategic collaboration with Sandsoft, a mobile first game developer, publisher, and investor based in uh, Raida, Raida, Saudi Arabia, powered by AAA talent. This partnership is set to drive the Sandbox expansion into Saudi Arabia and Middle Eastern markets. So, guys, expanding, right? Going further global, trying to get those big name companies and other countries and stuff globally into the sandbox um, ecosystem, uh, playing a pivotal role in the attracting in, in attracting local gaming talent and cultivating uh, educational and job opportunities within the region. <clears throat> the core objective of this collaboration is to assemble a team of experts in web3 gaming together they will establish partnerships with local public and private industries stakeholders entertainment entities ips ips and brands uh, and celebrities to explore the potential of game game fight social experience within the sandbox uh, the initiative also focuses on empowering local creative talent by facilitating the educational and onboarding of development developers and artists into the Sandbox ecosystem. Uh, it is worth noting that Sandbox offers a... I just got to cough again. Sorry, guys, this cough just doesn't want to let me finish a video. My goodness. Anyways, it's worth noting that the Sandbox offers a, pre, uh, a press start internship program which is designed to offer opportunities and uh, for talented youth in Saudi Arabia to enhance their game developers skills under the guidance and seasoned industry professionals, including a VP studio, Yashir uh, Korshi, probably butchered it, but formerly of EA Zynga, uh, the CTO Ahmed Sharif, 
previously of Meta, Sony, Sony, and EA. So there's a lot of big names behind this, guys. Uh, the Sandbox uh, platform boasts a uh, roster of over 400 partners, including names such as Warner Music Group, Ubisoft, uh, Rabbids, Gucci Vault, The Walking Dead, Snoop Dogg, and Atari. According to the company, their vision revolves around empowering players to craft their own experience using both original and well-known characters uh, and worlds. I'm going to get the hiccups now. Ushering in a new era of gaming for digital interaction. Very bullish on Sandbox, guys. Again, I do hold some. But, uh, yeah. Number two, let's have a look. Uh, VRA, Veracity. Very bullish on this. Uh, I just, I don't like the circulating supply being 10.22%. Uh, I would prefer it was uh, significantly higher than that. Uh, so I might wait to buy in on this one until we get more of a dump into circulation. Uh, but I'm always transparent, as you guys know. Right now, you can pick it up over on KuCoin, BitHub, Uniswap, uh, Bitfinex. Uh, so yeah, I mean, let's have a look at what we got. Veracity is an open ledger ecosystem designed to fight uh, advertising fraud, uh, provide open access to infrastructure for publishers and advertisers and, re and reward users for watching video content. Veracity also provides payment solutions and rewarding staking ecosystem with 15% yield guaranteed through to April 2024. Right around the halving. Uh, powered by a mix of artificial intelligence, machine learning, and cutting-edge blockchain technologies, Veracity is building the most powerful advertising ecosystem in the world through VeraViews, developing an open access payment platform through Vera Wallets, uh, the Vera Card, and Vera Pay, and enhancing the attention ecosystem or sorry economy through uh, its patent reward video module. So. Very bullish on this project, guys. Half a cent right now. Definitely worth uh, taking a flyer on, in my opinion. And then third one is Render. I love me some Render. 69.27% in circulation right now. Very bullish on this project as well, guys. Um, pick it up on Binance, Coinbase, KuCoin, Kraken, uh, Uniswap. So let's see. Render token has seen a 305% spike in value during the past year. Render token um, is also trending uh, on the charts. This is a, a provider of decentralized GPU-based solutions. The render token ecosystem is vast, and artists utilize its services on a global scale. However, during the last 24 hours, the render tokens volume jumped by 365.24%. In addition, the render token crypto traded between $1.75 and $1.82 during the past week. During the past year, render climbed 315%. In the past 30 days alone, render is up 13.2%. According to the render token price prediction, it can surge to $2.52 by the end of this year. So very bullish on render as well, you guys. Um, those are three top uh, metaverse plays that I believe you should be adding to your watch lists uh, and definitely doing some research on it, guys. Um, they're ones that I definitely hold for full transparency. Um, there's a lot that didn't make the list guys. I was only doing three, uh, make a short video here, but, uh, there's definitely other ones. Gala, for example, uh, mana, we like mana as well. Uh, but we only have time for three. So, uh, if you want more, we'll do more. Let me know. Uh, so that is it for this one. Smash a like, smash the subscribe button, guys. Join the Gem Hunters by clicking the join button down below to support the channel. Get exclusive content over there. Uh, find out what we're doing, uh, our exit plans, help you create an exit plan for the bull run. And I'll see you guys in the next one.